seven, six, five, four, three, Passing uh, 2 minutes 11 seconds, altitude now 15.7 nautical miles, velocity 3,740 feet per second, downrange distance 11.2 nautical miles. Passing uh, 2 minutes 30 seconds, still looking good. Chamber pressure is holding well, engine control is good. Coming up on 2 minutes 44 seconds, mark 2 minutes 44 seconds, the Delta IV vehicle now only weighs one half of what it did at launch 2 minutes 50 seconds ago. We're expelling propellant at the rate of 4,730 pounds per second. Coming up on 3 minutes into the flight, mark 3 minutes. Altitude now 28.6 nautical miles, velocity 7,175 feet per second, downrange distance 45 nautical miles. About uh, 40 seconds now remain on the uh, three booster flight. As we're passing uh, three minutes 30 seconds, mark three minutes 30 seconds into the flight, less than a half a minute now until our Port and starboard boosters go to the partial thrust mode in preparation for separation. Three minutes, 50 seconds, and passing. Standing by the partial thrust mode. Partial thrust mode, we can see the port and starboard booster dropping down. And we have the SEP command. Separation of the port and starboard booster. Core booster now ramping up to 100% thrust. And we just heard Steve Agate confirm jettison of the port and starboard common booster cores and the mission continues nominally. Our next event is main engine cutoff, or MECO, and that'll take place about a minute from now. Let's go back to Steve Agad. Velocity 15,731 feet per second, downrange distance 205 nautical miles. Four minutes, 50 seconds in. 
about uh, 35 seconds now remain on the first stage flight. Now passing five minutes, mark five minutes into the flight, chamber pressure continuing to hold on the first stage. Five minutes, 20 seconds in. Standing by to go to the partial thrust. And we have going to partial thrust on the core booster. Standing by for Miko. And we have Miko. Standing by for one, two, step. And we have the NEDS is deploying into, into, uh, into position. Standing by for ignition. You have the igniter spark. And we have ignition. Ignition on the second stage. Second stage chamber pressure is building. Good chamber pressure on the second stage. Good engine control on the second stage. Recovering from the initial transients. Standing by for fairing SEP. And we have fairing SEP. This is Delta Mission Control at L plus 6 minutes and 51 seconds. And we've just seen the successful liftoff of the NROL 32 mission for the National Reconnaissance Office. And at this point, all systems continue to operate nominally. Liftoff occurred at 5.58 p.m. Eastern Time this evening. At this point, I'd like to thank Steve Agate for his support of today's broadcast. And at the request of our customer,